Hey, this is David Young. I'm Chief Engineer at Radius Networks. I'm here to tell you a little bit about iBeacon Advertisements. First of all, if you want to learn about the basics of beacon technology, check out our Beacons 101 video. Well, what are iBeacon Advertisements? Well, iBeacon is a standard created by Apple for Bluetooth Low Energy Advertisements. They actually come out at about 10 times per second. And there are four fields in each of these advertisements, so the first three of which are used for the beacon identifiers. The first identifier is called the proximity UUID. This is used to be the same thing for your entire organization or company generally. You make one of these with a UUID generator, and so you don't have to register it with any central authority. There are so many different possible combinations of UUIDs, the possibility of creating one that's the same as somebody else's is less than you being struck by a meteorite. The second identifier is called the major. It's a two byte value that ranges between zero and 65535. It's usually used to group your beacons in some kind of logical area, and you can use it in iOS to trigger apps in the background when you see something in this group. The third identifier is called the minor. Again, it is a two-byte value that ranges from 0 to 65535. This is often used as a sequential ordering of your beacons, number 1, number 2, number 3, number 4, but there's nothing that enforces you have to do it this way. In fact, you're free to set the exact same value for every single miner or the exact same value for every single one of these beacon fields. It all depends on how you want to set it up. The final field in an iBeacon advertisement is the power calibration value. It is a one byte value that tells you how, what the estimated signal strength is at one meter away from the beacon as received by an iOS device. This allows you to get a distance estimate of how far your mobile phone or tablet is away from the beacon transmitter. These are all the fields that are in an iBeacon advertisement. It's very simple, but it allows you to, as a building block, create some very powerful applications. If you want to learn more about beacons, check out our other videos or go to the RadiusNetworks.com link at the bottom of this video.